Let's just let's just do Buffalo and get it out of the way. Um, I'll just push battle. I don't even care. I know the ship's ready to go. Battle. Bam. Buffalo. Summers. Hindi. Minotaur. Minotaur. A man after my own heart. All right, we'll give it a shot. <sighs> but yeah, no, it's been a it's been a good week. It's been a good week. Um, I hope you guys got to watch Scuttlebutt yesterday. If you're not keeping up with things, um, I'll just give you the the dump here. Hopefully, you you keep up with things on YouTube. If not, all week over on YouTube, every single video I post, I'm giving away something. Usually it's a tier, it's a premium ship. Usually it's a premium ship. Um, I have one giveaway this week that's not a premium ship, and that is a tier 10 permanent camouflage for a tier 10 ship of your choice. In other words, if you win that one, I'm going to reach out, contact you, you're going to tell me what ship you want it for and what server you play and all that stuff, and then Wargaming will just give you that camouflage. Um, this is not bad matchmaking. Uh, we've got a radar, they've got one, we've got one, maybe two, probably not. To Jurassic Park. Niles, thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Um, so, anyways, uh, that's going over on over on YouTube. So, if you want to win free stuff, go check out go check out the YouTube channel this week. Now, with that said, um, in order to enter all those, you usually have to do one little silly thing. You have to visit my Instagram page or visit you know follow me on Twitter or whatever. They're real simple to do, guys. And honestly. The giveaway doesn't even care if you unfollow me afterwards, right? So if you absolutely can't stand me and you just want to follow me to get the entry and then unfollow me later, I do it's fine. You do you, man. I don't care. I'm not fussed, right? Um, so um, and then um, the next thing, the other thing that I'm that I'm hoping to get over the hump for soon-ish is um, the uh, I get I get another one of these for to do on Twitch at 10,000 Twitch followers. And last I checked, I was at like 9,715 or something. So between now and the end of the King of the Sea, fingers crossed, we can hit that 10,000 mark. So it's possible that sometime in October, I'll have even more crap to give away here on Twitch, um, just depending on if we cross the, the follower threshold. So that would be nice as well. Kyle's got his entry in for Vanguard. Ooh, fancy. Fancy, fancy. I like Vanguard. My chat, you guys, you guys are the ones that convinced me to play Vanguard. I used to look at that ship and go, Ugh. and then one day I took it out and they were like, everybody in chat was like, why are you firing HE, you idiot? Stop, stop that. What? Fire the AP, moron. Okay. And then about three salvos later, it was like, oh, okay. The ship's not so bad after all. <laughs> are you like, what with Emerald? No, Emerald is, still, Emerald is still a meme. Listen to my wife. Whose side are you on anyway? Mine, yeah, I, mine, yeah, I knew the answer to that question. I knew, knew the answer to that question when I asked it. I don't know why I bother asking these things. All right, Colombo, Hindi, Brindisi's cutting the inside, Izumo, I'm lit. That means there's a destroyer about to be in my radar range. What do you bet? Now, he's not in the cap yet, which I find very curious. Oh, that's going to hurt. The Colombo just casually takes away half my health because it bothered it bothered to pull the trigger. I really really hate really really hate some of these ships these days. There's just they're just utterly ridiculous. You are crazy son of a bitch, you did. Niles with the sub. Thank you so much. Welcome in. Appreciate that you just got here and you're already subscribing. Well, thank you. Goodness. One of the things I learned about Twitch a long time ago was never expect that, but thanks, guys. And Angus with a follow. Appreciate that. You did. You crazy son of a bitch. You did. Winner with the resub. How you doing, man? How you doing? What is this team doing exactly? I am I am mightily confuzzled at the moment. Ladies and gentlemen, I am mightily confuzzled. Our two destroyers are doing the work here, trying to cap C, which I approve of. Try not to take a torpedo. You're going to take a torpedo. Did you miss the part where I said try not to take a torpedo? It isn't that hard, kids. Especially since you're literally under the Wooster's guns now. The Wooster is going to melt you. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome to Tier 10. Make a mistake and die. Welcome to Tier 10. 
Well, they have one, two, three battleships. Uh, uh, yeah, there's like seven ships on this flank. Oh, we got the look at the Chengmu. All right, that's that's at least passable. I'm not hanging out on this flank. I have no support. Welcome. Every battleship I have is basically Don't running away like a child. So that ain't hanging out. You did it. You crazy son of a bitch. You did Mmm. Hi, Wooster. How you doing, buddy? You did it. How we feeling? You're crazy, son. Secret with the resub! Gentlemen with the resub. Guys, welcome in. Appreciate you. Thank you kindly. American Piercing uh, said hello to that particular Wooster. Arkita needs to not be where he is. Arkita is dying. Like, he's he's melting. What? Stop. Leave. What are you doing up there, dude? Just go. All right. Their destroyer on this flank is dead. Their destroyer at the A flank, the ZF-6, is alive. Our kid on this flank is probably not long for the game, so we'll have to figure this out here. Sith with the resub! Thank you so much. Welcome in, Sith. How you been? All right, let's see here. Can I get a shot on this clown? Problem is, if I do that, I'm probably exposing myself to shots that I don't want to take, but let's do it anyway. Yep. Welcome. There's the there's the numb skull. Hope the Monty lumps that uh, beats the hell out of that dude. There we go. There we go. Oh really, Mr. Goliath? Come on, AP. Come on, AP. Come on, AP. Oh, this could be so good. Come on, AP. Yes. No, hit him again. Hit him again. No, hit him again. <laughs> I think I'm behind him. Uh, three more pens. All right, so we clipped him at the end there. How's it going, Dan? Yeah, we're okay. We're okay. It's, you know, we're here doing what we do. All right, the ZF6 on the other flank looks like he's getting wrecked. Our Veneto is out. The Goliath is trying to cap B? What is happening in this game, ladies and gentlemen? The heavy cruiser in B is capping. Guys, you're okay with this? Oh, my lord. Who'd I miss? Sandrin with the, Sandrin with the follow. Thank you kindly. Tired, Sith Kitten says. Well, I feel you there. I feel you there. I've got to. I've got to get on a better sleep schedule. That's always my problem. I go to bed too late, and then I have to live in the world of the daywalkers. It's murder. It's absolute murder. All right, we're gonna cap A. I'm gonna let him have B for now. For now. I really want to spot this Goliath, but I can't in this crappy weather. There he is. All right, Monty, I need you to hit him. I need you to hit him. Three more pens. He's getting low. Hit him again. Hit him again. Stern turrets will get over. So they're going to cap C. We can't possibly keep them out of C at this point. And apparently nobody can cap A. Whatever that's about. Oh, good. Okay, we got the Goliath. Cheeky bastard. Look at that, guys. We're only 100,000 hit points down. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong at this stage? Hold on. This Wooster has not considered his position very carefully. He thinks he has. We are here to disabuse him of this notion.
<laughs> All right, let's see. How do they keep reset? Oh, for God's sake. I will also kill the other destroyer, since apparently no one will! Alright, Wooster's out. That's useful. Vermont is a fight we can contribute to. What does that leave us with? The mines is... The mines is the are way out. We need to get up here and kill the ZF-6. We're gonna get up here and do that. He's clearly hanging around this cap. Oh, that's right. Minotaur. You're clearly not a radar Minotaur, so that's not useful. Ronberg! Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Okay, guys. I need you to own a cap circle, please. Alright, radar's gonna be up. ZF apparently is pristine, which I find more than a little irritating. The Bismarck at 15 clicks is firing HE at the Minotaur. You know, like you do. Oh, hi. Look who I found. You're going to be dead the next time I pull the trigger, dude. Yeah, you are screwed, sir. So that's the Bryn to see. He's about to thump me. Here's the good news. In the weather, I can cap. So we're going to cap and head back. Um, Battlefrog, the, the latest, most recent uh, double research point thing was not that long ago. Um, so I think you're probably still about, I'd say, 10 weeks out. They just they just had that back at not, re not long ago. So, yeah. Should be coming up again pretty soon. I mean, uh, a ways out, I should say. I want to say maybe November, December, something like that. I feel like August was when it reset last time. So yeah, November is probably right. Who, who remembers what the thunderstorm effects are? I cannot remember. It's killing me right now. The thunderstorm effects are like it reduces your visibility and worsens the incoming. It, it, it changes it changes like three major things. I remember that. I've been kind of using it to move east uh, east to west across the map here. This team is not going to win. They have fought all every single battleship they have is still alive. All of mine have committed suicide. So this is going to end very badly for my team. Hetman with the resub. Thank you so much. Welcome in. Appreciate you. All right. Well, we got a cap, but we have a three ship deficit. We're upside down 120,000 HP. We have no vision, no ability to stop these battleships. So, yeah. And that's why you poured the bourbon. And that's why we poured the bourbon. The good news is I'm going to get a de I'm going to have some decent XP out of this game, but that's about it. All right. I'm going to get up here and brawl with this Bismarck because I can do it and I can crush him. Um, actually, yeah, no, flip the guns. I need to flip the guns. Okay, yeah, I still need to flip the guns. Get the guns flipped, because when we're going in, we're turning to port. I can beat a Bismarck in a brawl. He could, pop, he could probably ram me. There's not much I can do about that, but... If I can avoid the ram, I can beat a Bismarck in a brawl. I've done it before. Okay. All right. We're slowly, inexorably, painfully catching up. All right. Where's this guy? I want to know where he's at. Okay. He's just driving into the cap, doing cap things. All right. So we put the guns over the starboard side. We're going to come into the cap, turn to port, and um, try to do what we can do here. But... The team is absolutely determined to lose, so this might this still might not work. 
No suffering through convoy night to mo uh, mode tonight. I mean, my my uh, I can't take it tonight. It can't. It just I can't. Mmm. Delicious full pins. There will be more soon. Mmm, delicious full pins. Nope, those all bounced. It's fine. There we go. There's the 11k hit I was looking for. Let's hit him again. Suck it. Told you I could beat a Bismarck in a brawl. Told you I could beat a Bismarck in a brawl. Alright. Problem is we can't see the Vermont. And that is the problem. All right, we can't see the Vermont. I might have shots on the Colombo, but I basically have to leave the cap to the north. It's me and the Minnow? Oh, what the hell happened to this team? Oh, my God. No eyes on the Vermont. There's the Vermont. I can do really mean things to that Vermont, but he can also do really mean things back to me, so yikes. I have no I have no range on the North Carolina. The Colombo is probably gonna charge in because he knows he can. The Vermont I'm not sure what that dude's gonna do. Four minutes, and we're 400 points down? Yeah, we can't win this, but I can probably do more damage and just make a general nuisance of myself on the way out. But that's about where this is going to end. Our team depends upon you. Oh, I'm gonna, they're going to let me brawl with the Vermont? All right, well. Guys, here comes our last stand. At least it will be entertaining. It will not be successful, but it will be fun to watch. So, get your popcorn ready, boys. What's up, Chex? Get your popcorn ready, boys. The entertainment's coming. That angle, the AP's never going to land. He's probably looking right at me, too. He's got to be looking right at me. That's going to hurt. Ha! <laughs> Jackass. <laughs> I told you it wasn't going to work. <laughs> Here, let me just shove these 18-inch guns in your face. If only... What's the mantra around here, guys? If only my team had decided to show up to play. Ah, yes. The mantra of every good Tier 10 battle in World of Warships. Ah, well. C'est la vie. Oh my holy god, would you look at this result screen. <laughs> like, look, this is a conqueror. This is battleship on easy mode, okay? Sit in the spawn and throw HE at things, and you have 500 XP? What did you do exactly? Confused screaming. Yes, a lot of that going on right now. <laughs> what in the actual hell? So, McGib, here's my thing, right? A, you're not wrong. B, again, for better or for worse, and I've said this on the channel before, my expectation is that by the time you have a tier 10 ship, you at least know what buttons to push, okay? You at least know what buttons to push, and you probably, hopefully, even know what order to push those buttons in. I'll be honest, with a Conqueror, you don't have to do anything. You can play Conqueror one-handed. Think about this for a minute. You can sit, you can take a Conqueror into a game and 
load and never load anything but high explosive, right? And just sit here and and eat bonbons and fire shells with your right hand and be and and honestly contribute more to the match than that that dude with 500 XP probably just did.